Austin North is breaking his silence over his recent arrest. The Outer Bank star was arrested for gross misdemeanor battery on February 13th after allegedly attacking staffers at a Las Vegas emergency room, according to a police report obtained by TMZ. The actor shared a lengthy statement addressing the incident to his Instagram story on February 15th, writing, I am deeply upset by the events that took place in Las Vegas this past week. My friend drove me to the hospital because I thought I was having a heart attack. Several tests were taken, including blood, which came back negative for any drugs or alcohol in my system. I was having a severe anxiety attack. I have very little memory of the events that day at the hospital. I have the utmost respect for healthcare workers and hospital staff. I have battled anxiety on and off for years, and this was the most extreme panic attack I've ever had. Going forward, I hope to shed light on this debilitating disorder and send hope to those who have also struggled. In the police report from that day, Austin was accused of punching one nurse in the head as well as shoving two other healthcare workers during a visit to U. UMC Hospital per TMZ. Authorities said in the report that security officers managed to restrain him to a gurney after one of the staffers hit him with a tray in self-defense. North was in Las Vegas over the weekend for the 2024 Super Bowl celebrations. Seen in a video posted to Instagram February 14th, the actor attended several parties, including meeting Rob Gronkowski during the NFL icons bash at Encore Beach Club. In a statement to E! News, the UMC Public Relations Director Scott Kerb said the hospital, quote, can not share details about specific patient interactions in order to protect patient privacy, adding, however, that violence against healthcare professionals, our community heroes who devote their careers to helping others, is always reprehensible. UMC remains committed to maintaining the safest possible environment for our team members, patients, and visitors. E! News has reached out to Las Vegas police for comment, but hasn't heard back.